So to, to extend the fuselage, we uh, brought it 24 inches uh, longer, four inches wider and four inches taller to accommodate the uh, extra seats in the back. And that should be plenty of room to give that conference style seating in the back that people like to see. The change from a turboprop to a piston stemmed from the added cost now from the PBS TP100s. When we first designed the airplane, the, the engines cost about $70,000 each. Now they're at $155,000. So instead of dropping the $300,000 just for engines, we went with the UL520 turbocharged engines, which make the same horsepower when you put the intercooler on it. It makes a good partnership with, with our buddies over at, at UL. Yeah, so we actually already have uh, fuselage molds produced for, for this stretch version. The wings are prototyped you know, with foam core and fiberglass skins. And the plan is to fly it later this year. It's actually owned by one of our customers who used to fly an XL, so he'll be doing the full test program with one of us on board, obviously, to, to record some data. Then as soon as he's done flying it, he plans to just take it to every air show around the country to start showing off uh, the product. To do a single engine version of this, we just need a bigger engine on the back. Uh, it's definitely possible, and it's something we've made the fuselage mold able to accommodate. I think the kits will be available for deposit later this year, okay. and we'll produce the first kit early next year. The market hasn't been attempted often for building a six-seat experimental airplane. By just making a simple to build airplane with good performance, I think we can provide a nice aircraft for those who want that extra room in the back. Even if it's just four people with a lot of baggage, um, this would be a great platform. And we just, we, that's our plan. Hopefully it flies right. We, you know, we'll see when, when the time comes. Aviation Safety Resources is disrupting the market for aircraft emergency parachute recovery systems. ASR systems are smaller, lighter weight, and offer longer repack cycles than similar products available in the current market. ASR has a recovery system available for every type of aircraft. Sport, experimental, light sport, general aviation, urban air mobility, vertical takeoff and landing, electric propulsion, and unmanned aerial systems. Find the right product for your aircraft at AviationSafetyResources.com.